Windows like Windows 8, Windows 10 and Windows 11 are designed to automatically download and install the updates as Microsoft releases, but sometimes due to bug or error your OS might fail to boot up and takes you to blue screen, black screen, or a message of a boot failure error. Don't worry, because in this video we're going to show you how to fix Windows 10 won't boot issue using six methods. Before we get started, subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on any future videos. The Startup Repair tool automatically fixes many common problems. The tool also lets you quickly diagnose and repair more complex startup problems. When the computer detects a startup problem, the computer starts the Startup Repair tool. Here's how to launch Startup Repair manually. Power on your system and press F8 and select Troubleshoot in Options screen. Now in the Advanced Options screen, select Startup Repair. After that, your system will restart several times during repairing. If still Windows cannot boot properly, let's move to next solution. Safe mode is a way to boot your Windows with only the bare essentials, such as device drivers and other important files. Here's how to boot into the safe mode. Open settings from start and select update and security. Navigate to recovery. Under advanced startup, select restart now. After your PC restarts to the Choose an Option screen, select Troubleshoot, Advanced Options, Startup Settings, and click on Restart. After that, you'll see a list of options. Simply press F8 to start your system in safe mode. After entering safe mode, try to restart your system normally. In Option Blue screen, you can access Command Prompt window. Using it, you can enter Fix Booting Issue using several commands. Follow step-by-step -step commands to fix your system using Fix Boot. On the Options screen, choose Troubleshoot, then choose Advanced Options and finally open Command Prompt. After opening Command Prompt, you need to type first command that it bootrex slash fixber and hit Enter. Now type second command bootrex slash rebuild and hit Enter. Now all commands are performed successfully. Close the Command Prompt and launch Windows normally using Continue option. If you found that this blue screen error occurring after updating Windows 10, then you can try to uninstall a latest Windows update. Open Setting from Start menu and navigate to Updates and Security. Choose Windows Updates. Now click on Advanced option and choose View Recent Updates History. If you want to uninstall updates, click on Install Updates on the top. The page Installed Updates would open, and you can uninstall updates easily by right-clicking the specific update. After successfully transfer OS to your target disk with 4D Dig Partition Manager, you're probably wondering how to boot your computer from the new drive after transferring your entire system to it. Here's how you can do. Open the back portion of laptop and remove the old hard drive disk and insert the new drive into the original slot. Now it's time to power on your system and press corresponding key to enter BIOS menu such as F2, F8 and delete keys. After entering BIOS menu, navigate to boot menu and choose new drive as startup disk and restart the computer using F10 command. That's it. Now you can successfully boot your PC from the new drive. If Windows 10 won't boot after so many attempts and won't boot issues still exist after trying the above solutions, you can try the last method performing Reset the PC to fix issue. Here's how to reset the PC. Step 1. Press the X and Windows keys simultaneously to open the menu. Step 2. Pick settings from that menu and go to Update and Security. Step 3. Then at that point, pick Recovery on the left pane. Step 4. You should see a reset option on the right. Step 5. Click the Get Started button. Step 6. In the next window, Select Remove Everything option. Now choose Local Reinstall. It will reinstall Windows again. Step 7. Choose Next in the new window and finally hit Reset. While resetting, it will remove all your personal files, user accounts, settings, apps, programs, and operating system. To avoid this type of booting issue, you should regularly update your BIOS menu, drivers updates, and Windows updated to latest one. That's how you can easily avoid this type of booting issues. Hopefully, you were able to fix Windows 10 won't boot issue using above methods. For migration, optimization, and managed disk partitions, we strongly recommend to use 4 Dig Partition Manager. 
so make sure to check it out. Subscribe to our channel if you want more useful tips. See you next time.